In this video, we're continuing with our email automation. And I thought this would be a good opportunity to see the limitations of different platforms, but how we can actually connect them together. If you remember yesterday, we set up an email automation that triggers when a specific email comes in. And I'm now running this on my hello at nfps.ir uh, email address. And I'm capturing when a contact us form has been submitted and I receive this email in my inbox. And I can see that it comes from hellofnfps.ir. So that's the filter that I'm using to identify which emails I want this automation to run by. Because we don't have an automatic filter for this, we're running it every hour. But now that I'm actually thinking about it, I might look at if I can actually run a webhook from the actual contact us form uh, to make it a bit quicker. But We'll carry on with this for an example. We're continuing to pass the HTML to text. This also may not 100% be needed because I saw that the text does come out in a different way, but um, we're gonna stick with what we've got. And we're using OpenAI to summarize that email into a single text message. So we've got here John Smith, blah, blah, with his very long phone number, I don't know why I put it in for so long, requests an automation to summarize emails and text them to himself. And we can see that is what is from here. John emailed and said, I would love to have an automation built that can summarize emails and text them to myself. So where was the next step? As I showed yesterday, we had a Twilio option, but I don't have a Twilio account. And I really wanted to use an app called Contiguity, which can send 5,000 free text messages a month. Make doesn't have Contiguity, but Active Pieces does. So what we've used here is an HTTP module, which is actually sending this information to a webhook address. And then Active Pieces picks it up, picks up this information through the webhook, and then uses Contiguity to send that text message. So if we look at the webhook here, we can see that it received the message. John Smith requests an automation to summarize emails and text them to himself. The exact same data that was sent over there comes through instantaneously here. And then we use contiguity, which sent this text message to myself and it worked perfectly. So the use case is, Anytime someone fills in this contact form, it gets sent to me as an email. And this runs every hour to check if that email has come through. So it sends through that summary, the AR summary of a one sentence text to uh, through a webhook to active pieces, which then set, uses contiguity to send it to me. Maybe a little bit of a roundabout way. I'm definitely going to explore to see if the uh, contact us form has a webhook option so we'll carry on with that in the next video but again just hopefully to get some ideas going about how you can utilize these flows to get yourself information that's needed i don't always have an opportunity to check my hello at nfps.ar email address i'm often busy with things and i'd like to know when someone has put an inquiry in so that i can get to them very quickly and this allows me to do that with a schedule that runs every hour from seven in the morning until eight at night. You can even select the different days and months that this runs. Um, so hopefully this has given you a few ideas about how you can automate some automate uh, some notifications from your emails. And as always, if you've got any questions or you've got an automation that you'd like me to tackle, please drop it in the comments. Otherwise, I look forward to seeing you tomorrow as we continue with our automation challenge.